let's begin our journey at Best Buy. Best Buy has something I've never seen before. Look at this. Each product is locked individually. Each blister has its own little lock box or whatever. This is insanity. i never seen anything like this, man. This is crazy. Look at that. Ready Collection 2 is locked, uh, except for this guy for some reason. Even the top loaders are locked. Yeah, I mean, this is insanity. Yeah, I think I've seen enough. Let's try a different store. Now let's go to Target. Target has some cool blisters. Uh, I think that's the way it should be, you know. Yeah, uh, yeah. This that set, man. I'm gonna skip that set. I'm not gonna buy any any more. I'm done with that set. That set hates me. Now this set, Ready Collection Two, it's awesome. A little bit too expensive, so I might have to skip it. Overall, man, uh, Target was loaded. Unfortunately, it was loaded, but not with you your product as much. Now let's try the second best store on this planet, Wally World. Walmart had these mini boxes, which are great. I'm gonna have to buy a couple of them because. This product is good for the challenge of today's video, which I'm gonna you know explain in a little bit. Now, Red Collection 2, guys, even though every pack has value, I'm gonna have to skip it, it's just too expensive. Now, I cannot believe they still you know sell this power cube, man. If you guys see this power cubes, do not buy. Now, the GOAT, the greatest of all time, the best store, period. Guys, check this out. They had the cast boxes, which I'm gonna buy two because for today's challenge, these are really good, also. The mystery power boxes of the holiday editions are really good for today's video, and I'm gonna explain why in just a second. Now, I am on a budget, otherwise, I'd probably buy more of Lexi of Destruction mini boxes. That said, it's amazing, but yeah, also, I'm gonna show you guys something really cool. I found three dollar blisters, and even though they're only three bucks, I don't think they're still you know valuable or uh, or worth it in my opinion this older you know uh sets don't have that much value but i'm gonna buy them maybe for a different day or a different video who knows man. overall great products and yeah wish me luck you guys in today's video i spent 100 dollars and we're gonna try to profit but it's a little bit different than before Everything I pull from this product is gonna go towards a counter that is that includes structure decks, as leaves, etc. Hence why this product might be good for today's video. And this will be also a challenge against my guy Apollo Yu-Gi-Oh! He challenged me. He told me that he wanted to do this. You know, the more uh, whoever gets a more product or the best product, the uh, the better product i guess overall wins this challenge so make sure guys to go check out his channel and his video which is going to be linked in the description he also going to go to the stores buy the best product that he can get i cannot wait to see what he got though and speaking of apollo yugio he did send us a package now check this out i wanted it to showcase my dark magician and my dark magician girl matt which i absolutely love but in today's video is going to be something different and this was sent to me by Apollo Yugi. Apollo, man, thank you so much. It's amazing. I guess he wants to be obliterated. You know, he wants to be sent into the Shadow Realm. By the way, guys, whoever loses this challenge or this battle goes into the Shadow Realm. And my boy, Apollo Yugi, also provided the giveaway and something for me. Uh, it says, read first. Check it out. It says, Dear Heart of Pack, you have been an insp in inspiration to me and gave me courage to start my own channel. That's amazing. So it's only fair we have a fun head-to-head -head battle. A battle, I agree. Sensei versus pupil. Open the letter. Grab the master card. Uh, I'll have my card on my video. Okay, so he's gonna have a different card on his video. Go check it out, guys. So let's see what he's got for me. Oh! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Apollo Yugi. Wait, 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 wait. I am not too familiar with Naruto. Let's see first. Wait. Oh, oh, this is nice, man. So, this is Naruto, though? Wait, isn't he the student? Wait, uh, is this guy Naruto's? Oh, no, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. I do like it, though, a lot. Wait, is there something inside? Oh, this is cool. I didn't even know these guys had their own TCG. Or this even? Oh, no, man. It's cool. Thank you so much, Apollo Yu Gi Oh! Let's check out the giveaway. He didn't mention it was gonna be a cool giveaway. Oh, Master Duel. Okay, that's a cool sleeve. Oh, mystery. There's two. Oh, wait, no, no. Oh, wait, I thought it was sleeve. Never mind. Okay, cool. And Ultimate Rare Cyber Jar. Wow. That's an awesome giveaway. Guys, if you're interested, all I ask is to make sure to go check out Apollo Yu Gi Oh! I'm gonna leave again his video down in the description and let us know in the comments 
who do you think won this battle you know who got the best deals you know the best overall product in your opinion let us know in the comments and please please make sure to go check out apollo Yu-Gi-Oh! what an awesome giveaway man let's start with this cast box these are only 9.99 and again man these are so good for this challenge because there's always going to be value uh out of this uh, boxes for example you was gonna get sleeves sleeves are gonna be always four or five bucks because that's right away have your money back and if we get lucky and we get like a five dollar you know pool luckily then money make uh made back just like that and let's go man the wife with sleeves nice yeah again guys the sleeves are gonna count count towards the counter i'm gonna start by the way with a negative 100 in red hopefully by the end of this video it's green so let's see we got lightning overdrive let's open it up again guys these are awesome uh not great anymore but we can always get lucky you know the starlight rares of course there's still uh some decent secrets i guess with some what of a value but anyways uh legendary duelist uh yeah the light editions yeah man uh when it comes to the overall products the uh, cast boxes are not that great they're not bad in my opinion but not that great so i just buy them because it's all about the potential value inside the product, not just the pools, if that makes any sense. So anyways, another shot for a Starlight Rare. I think that's probably pretty much everything, like all, like in this set, all with value, it's just Starlight Rares pretty much. Eh, the weather forecast. I'm only gonna count one card per pack, by the way, towards the counter. You know what? Another one, let's open up both. I only buy two of these guys. Uh, I didn't wanna go over the 100, unfortunately. Otherwise, I not thinking about it man i should have bought like four of these instead of no 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 the mini boxes are really good too man so anyways let's see let's see again man sleeves another four or five bucks whatever you know whatever they're selling for that's awesome and hidden summoners uh you know what there's potential for the summons call oh okay this is a good super refusion fulfillment of the contract ratio four gun nymphits the sacred flame beautiful i do love the fact they come all rare uh supers and a secret rare as well another light legendary duelist uh i could potentially get a hollow from this pack so i'll take it the potential is always there ah oh, secrets of the dark magic now last pack dimension force what are the odds man of us pulling starlight one in a lot <laughs> uh scare claw arrival dang man now, this mystery power boxes are also really cool because there's sleeves also and uh, uh, starter decks. And hopefully, I can get the Kaiba starter decks. This guy is only by itself like 20 bucks, so that would be awesome. Kaiba, please. Okay, you know what? Uh, Starter deck, Cyber Strike. This is like, what, 10 bucks or so? So, yeah, I'll take it. We do have another blister. Oh, Bell Legends, Crystal Revenge. Okay, I'll take it. Now, these are potential for Starlight Rares. Let's see. Come on. Can we get lucky? The Chaos Creator. Back when it was amazing. Uh, yeah, so many reprints. Uh, again, man, the older packs are not that great anymore. So another blister of Tactical Master. Potential for Collector's Rare. Come on. Any Collector's Rare would be amazing, you know? Here we go. Oh, Kyung Weezen. I forgot the... Uh, if there's a hit, it should be all the way in the back of the pack. Now, let's see. The next is Genesis Impact. Okay, another... Collector's Rare set. I remember Genesis Impact when it first came out. It was so, so good. Number, uh, wait. Wait, is this European? Or did we get lucky? I think it's European. Yeah, it is European. The European packs are always the hits on the back. Now, okay. So, we do have more of the waifu sleeves, which I'll take. Five, six bucks, something like that. That's awesome. Two more packs, and we got Cyber Horizon and Invention of Chaos. Let's open up this one. Let's see. Come on. Let's get something shiny. Secret rare will be amazing. This card feels kind of... Oh! Ultra rare decorating knights. Nice. I'll take a hit, man. I'll take it. And last pack of the mystery box. Hopefully, it's something good. Come on. Let's go. Don't turtle. And... Ah, uh, Lakunga. Ah, uh, last pack of the mystery box. Tragic. All right, now that was fun though. Now, Infinite Forbidden, uh, the mini box, I think is great because again, with the tokens, you are guaranteed value in every single box, whether it's only like a, f a few bucks or more, doesn't matter. So yeah, let's open up, I bought three of them. So yeah, let's open up all three. First mini box. I am curious to know what Apollo Yu-Gi-Oh got, man. Cannot wait to see. And let's hope. Ah, oh, Shaz Princeton. You know what, I'll take Shaz Princeton any day of the week. 
a lot of this product uh the secret rares especially on this set went up in value so any secret rare will be actually really good man again this set is amazing the mini boxes are awesome it's speaking of which first pack let's go like a 20 dollar car plus nice okay i'm feeling way better now about this challenge that's such a good secret maybe the third best or something like that and second pack is a dragon uh maybe go a dragon okay two more packs of the first first mini box man we got my boy shaz princeton awesome secret what else can i ask, ask for maybe another secret ah uh, ragnarok butterfly all right and last pack of the first mini box man i already paid for the mini box with that pool actually plus for that mini box cosmo queen uh, and an and another ultra secret ultra and chess i'll take it first mini box was amazing can this be just as good or even better hopefully and it is ah this guy <laughs> oh man i mean it's a token it's value and yeah it helps towards the counter so i guess i'm cool with that you know first pack come on another secret again man any secret at all it's actually kind of decent except maybe for one or two which are only a few dollars but every secret has value and yeah a lot of them went up in price let's go let's see ah oh, my bullshit queen which you know it's actually kind of weird now that i think about it a bunch of these cards went up but the price of the sealed product of the like the booster box actually went down isn't that weird i guess it's a good thing for us Ah, oh, okay, cool. And last pack of the second mini box. We still got one more mini box. And again, man, I'm feeling kind of good with this about this challenge. If I can make at least half of the money back, Vince Smith. If I can make at least half of the money back, I'll be really good. Last mini box, magic or tragic. Let's go. All right, last mini box. And my guy, Polly Yu Gi Oh! Thank you for the giveaway, man. Amazing giveaway. Thank you for my gift. Awesome, man. Good luck. And I cannot wait to see what you got man you know what? i'm feeling pretty good about this because the sleeves wait another chance prison again man i'll take my boy chance prison any day of the freaking week yeah man the sleeves the structure decks have value that 20 plus dollar card yeah i i think i might be able to do halfway through the challenge at least 50 bucks back okay come on spill card mon okay i think this monster reborn card is like a dollar and 50 cents something like that at least i'm hoping i'm right okay second pack three more packs come on if you get another good secret i think it's over man and ditron okay i mean one secret one ultra out of uh 16 wait 12 packs we need another ultra just to make it just like fair or average come on make it a good ultra at least oh millennium egg nice nice 10 bucks maybe two secrets man that's amazing Last pack, magic or tragic. Here we go. Shout out to Apollo Yu-Gi-Oh, man. Thank you so much once again. And guys, let's do this. Make sure to go check out his video, man. A lot in the description. Good luck, my guy. And gimmick puppet, fantastic machinix for last pack, tragic. And for the last time, thank you, Apollo Yu-Gi-Oh, for this amazing giveaway to one of you guys in the comments. Make sure to comment down below and make sure to comment on his video as well.